One of the most important characteristics that Al-Islam requires from us, Allah commanded everybody without any exception, and there are many, but one of the most important is the characteristic of justice, being fair and being just. Whether it's for yourself or against yourself, your relatives, you have to be fair and you have to be just. Allah Ta'ala mentioned in commanding the people to be fair and just, Be fair and just, even if it's against yourself, your mother and your father, and your relatives. If a person is going to be fair when it comes to himself, his mother and his father, then he's going to be fair for the people who are far away from him. Don't let the oppression and the misgivings of your enemies that they did bad to you, don't allow that to make you also do bad. But be fair and be just. This is closer to a taqwa. So the Muslim is not allowed to oppress someone because he was oppressed. To do wrong because wrong was done to him. He has to be fair and just. Just as Allah Azzawajal sent the prophets and the messengers, Salawatullahi wa salamu alayhim ajma'een, with a tawheed and to spread a tawheed, Allah sent the prophets and the messengers as well to establish justice. To establish justice. So the Muslim has to try to be just. There are just too many ahadith. Those seven people that Allah was shade, under his shade, on the day that there will be no shade, the very first person he mentioned was Imamun Adil, the fair and the just Imam. And there are six other people, but why were they mentioned? So that people can make efforts to try to be from those seven, or from one or two or three or four of them. Fair and just. In Allah yuhibbul nuqsitin. Allah loves those people who are fair and just. He said in an authentic hadith, Sallallahu alayhi wa ala alihi wa sallam, Taslim in kathira, Inna al muqsitin ala manabir, Inna al muqsitin, Inna Allahi yawm al qiyamati ala manabir, Min nur, Ala yameen al rahman, Wa kilta yadehi yameen, Alladheena yaadiluna fi hukmihim, Wa ahlihim, the people were fair and just, they would be upon members made of light, Yomul Qiyamah, on the right side of Allah. Those people, when they give a hukum, they're fair and just. When they deal with their families, they're fair and just. When they deal with what they have the wilaya on, they're fair and just. So if he has multiple children, he's fair and just. The smallest one and the eldest one, he's fair and just. He has multiple wives. He's faring just with his family. His daughter wants to get married. And she wants to marry someone other than the cousin or other than the one, the choice that the father or the mother wants. He's faring just in that he listens and he looks at the situation, not like this cultural nonsense that is destroying our community. Muslim men are going to jail because our daughters Due to the mother and the father being difficult, the girl runs off and gets married without the permission. And then the father and the father's brother, the sons of the girl, the brother of the girl, they go to beat the guy up, they got to go, got to, go to jail. Why? Because the father wasn't fair and just. The mother wasn't fair and just. The point is, justice is one of the most important characteristics that has to be embodied within the Muslim. No one is exempt. This first row to the last row, everyone in this masjid have to be fair and just in everything that you do.